Hi, this is Andrea Tukaji, Fighting for Justice Foundation. I'm here at Federal Parliament House. We've been engaged in uh, parliamentary lobbying today. It's the last sitting day of 2017. There's obviously a lot on, but uh, the proposed Modern Slavery Act is to pass here in Federal Parliament next year. So we've been talking to senators and members uh, in relation to some of our concerns and some of our recommendations subsequently. So, Fighting for Justice Foundation uh, seeks to ensure that the legislation that is passed, particularly in relation to uh, slavery, human trafficking, uh, exploitation, gender-based violence, is victim-centred and uh, it is holistic in its approach. So currently the Modern Slavery Act uh, does not um, has not been implemented first and foremost uh, and we want to ensure that when it is it is robust and thorough so for example we argue that there should be no threshold uh, for this legislation that all businesses and corporations should be held accountable for slavery in their supply chain including not only raw materials services in their supply chain but also service supply chains so we're talking about uh, in Australia um, at, currently we have slavery in raw material supply chains of seafood, uh, cocoa, uh, cotton and, and uh, tea in particular. It's been noted in uh, international reports. <clears throat> but the service supply chain of brothels is um, also a concern. So the brothel service supply chain uh, should be considered as a high risk industry and penalties subsequently should be applied to a lack of reporting for these companies because they are high risk and they engage in uh, not only exploitation and servitude but also uh, slavery of uh, vulnerable women and girls. So we are here at Federal Parliament lobbying uh, in relation to the proposed Modern Slavery Act and we do call upon those who want to see a robust uh, legislation to lobby with us and please do contact us fighting for fightingforjusticefoundation.com and uh, send us a letter or send us an email and we can talk to you about how you can be involved in lobbying in this space. We'd also like to uh, commend a, a anti-slavery commissioner to uh, the recommendations. We'd love to see an anti-slavery commissioner here in Australia. We would love to see a public repository system where all the reporting is uploaded. We'd also love to see um, you know, extra resources for law enforcement in this space. So our anti-trafficking and child protection teams within AFP need to be supported so that they can do their jobs well. So these are some of our recommendations and considerations for the proposed Modern Slavery Act. Uh, there is a lot of work to do in relation to post-implementation and uh, rise of this bill. So get in contact with us if you're interested in partnering with us not only for the lobbying part, but uh, the follow through. So we are currently preparing for next year and we'd love to see you on board with that. We'd love to engage with you in relation to compliance to this act if you're a business person or corporate entity. Fightingforjusticefoundation.com, get in touch, thanks.